Warning, graphic pest control. Please do not watch, you may be offended. Hello, welcome back to TA Hunters. Back out again, targeting the grey squirrel. This time, I've built myself up a brand new feeder. I thought I'd grab the dog, head out to the location, and set the feeder up. Feeding station's up and running now. Um, there's about six kilos of peanuts in there. Um, it's going to take a while for them to go down. Um, it's going to take maybe three days for the squirrels to locate where the feeding station is. Um, I'm going to head back in about five days. Just check it, make sure it's not damaged or anything like that. And uh, hopefully the peanuts will go down. If so, I'd retop them up and uh, come back on the 10th day and uh, hopefully take a few squirrels out. Right, coming back to the feeder now. I've just topped it up um, for the second time um, and the feed's going down very, very quick. Um, I was gonna use a, uh, like a screen, like a bit of netting in front of a tree and obviously we use a tree to stop me uh, silhouetting. But we have got bad weather coming again. I know it's a summer, but we have got a lot of rain. Um, instead, I've just stuck this hide up um, it is the 10th day and um, I'm going to leave this hide now for about another uh, four more days. I did say on the uh, 14th day I'll probably come back. Um, so yeah, I'm going to um, use this as my little base instead of using a uh, bit of netting against a tree. Um, right, I'm going to shoot off and uh, come back in uh, four days time. Right, I just got myself settled down and this greedy little magpie turned up. So sorry, but he had to go.
after shooting the magpie, um, I noticed she's a little woodpecker hanging around the feeder. Coming down for a bit of a bit of breakfast. So I thought I'd just sit back and enjoy the uh, bit of wildlife. Right, here we go. Um, squirrel number one. Let's start the action. Like this one is playing hard to get. A um, bit of patience now, we just have to wait until we get a clean shot. When this one finally settles down, I'll take him out of a perfect headshot. After shooting the squirrel, I noticed a bit of movement behind the feeder. And sure enough, we got ourselves a young deer. Good thing about having a hide, you can literally sit back, relax, and enjoy the wildlife go by. Especially watching this um, young deer play around with this dead squirrel.
why there's a little bit of banter going on at the feeder. Um, I think Mr. Squirrel is trying to do a bit of bullying, I think. But um, these two chicks are not having none of it. So, uh, yeah, what are you going to do now, Mr. Squirrel? Right, the two birds decide to do the off, um, leaving the Mrs. Squirrel to get on with it. Shame, shame. Wrong move, mate. Right, I was literally just about to pack up, um, decided to call it a day, and this magpie turns up. Yeah, he went smashing down into the brambles. That's where I left him. I weren't going to go in there and go and get him, so I left him to the foxes. Right, that's me done now. I'm gonna go and gather up what I've, um, what I've just shot. I know it's not a, uh, a lot, but it's better than nothing. Just nice to be out for a few hours doing a bit of pest control. Right, that's me all done now. I'm gonna pack that away, head home, and grab some lunch, because I'm absolutely starving. Um, don't forget to uh, like and subscribe, and um, I will see you again soon. And uh, stay safe.